Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel! So I'm a person who loves to drink soups, all kind of soups. So today, we will be doing our first soup recipe. We will be doing a very hearty and simple one. We will be doing Bakute. So you only need 5 simple ingredients from the wet market or supermarket. I am sure you can't wait to start cooking. But before that, do remember to like, share, comment, and subscribe to our YouTube channel and comment down below on the kind of video that you want to see us doing and also the kind of dishes that you want to see us cooking. So now, let's head to the kitchen! The 5 simple ingredients you need are 1.5 kg of pork ribs, 2 packets of baku teh spices. There's actually a lot of brand of baku teh spices that you can use. 2 blobs of garlic, 15 Chinese mushroom, 3. and lastly, white peppercorn. These ingredients used are of a serving of 8 in total. What I will be doing first is to soak the dried Chinese mushroom in hot water for about 45 minutes to an hour. You will need to hydrate the mushroom and it will be softer and nicer to eat later on. While the mushroom does its magic, we will briefly fry the peppercorn and the garlic until it is fragrant. You can skip this step if you don't want your soup to be too peppery. Next up, we will be handling our pork ribs. Look at the pork ribs here, it is so much! So, what we will be doing first is to blanch the pork ribs for about 5 minutes in hot water. The reason why we need to do so is to remove any impurities that will be floating on top later. We want to have a very nice and clear rich soup in the end. By blanching the pork ribs, it will also slightly remove the gamey taste of the pork. And one hour is up, and we are ready with the mushroom. It is time to start assembling and boiling the soup. So first up, we will need to pour about 3.6 liters of water into our pot and allow it to come to a boil. We will then proceed to add in the blanched pork rib, mushroom, fried garlic and peppercorn and not forgetting the sachets of spices. You know the drill here. Give it a good stir so that the sachet is submerged into the water. And remember, that's where all the flavours are. Allow the soup to simmer for about 1 hour and you can add salt to taste and you are very ready to serve the soup. And here we go in 3, 2, 1, go! And a very hearty and simple bakote soup is ready to be consumed. And not only it looks nice, tastes nice as well. And look at the colour and also the layer of oil on top of the soup. It is so just perfect. We have come to the end of the video. So do remember to tag us and comment us down below when you have tried the recipe. So with that, we will see you soon. Stay safe and take care!